Welcome back everybody. MTG Singles here. We have Unstable. We're going to have some fun today. So this is an interesting set. You know, it's the first set or so that um, <clears throat> kind of made fun of Magic the Gathering versus being a part of an expansion standalone set. 2017. Um, little fun fact, there have been, you know, some god boxes that have a foil uh, land in each pack. We'll see uh, maybe if we get lucky there. Um, <clears throat> so in these sets, really it's all about the foils and really it's about the land. So the, even the common lands have some value, two to four bucks, with the island being the most expensive. Uh, how do we open these bad boys? Let's figure out the best way to open them. There we go. Let's get some focus on here. And let's have some fun with Unstable. All right, so first we're, we're gonna just kind of look at some of the commons and have some fun with them. Uh, like I said, there's really no uh, non-foils that are worth much. There's a few rares that are worth, you know, three to four bucks, but it's all about the foils. And so we have our commons, a little dirty rat, work a double, riveting rigor, <laughs> a merman, a squirrel dealer. <laughs> I'm going to give that one to my kids. <laughs> I love the squirrels. All right, extremely so zombie. So that's our commons. Stamp of approval, uncommon. Crow storm. Five finger discount. Everything majig. I think that uh, I, I think that that's the rare that's actually worth three to four bucks. Believe it or not. So then what we got is a, a, a land. And then we get, um, and all of those I'm going to set aside because I'm going to try to uh, probably put all those together. And then we get what, what two contraptions. Sundering Fork and the Boom Finger. And then we have a foil token in each pack too. So, and they always, and some of them have something pretty funny on the back. Knowledge is power. <laughs> little social media. All right, so that was our first pack. Um, I, like I said, I think that everything majig is uh, actually a decent rare uh, for not being a foil. Paniac, Sacrifice Play, Little Crafty Octopus, Ground Pounder, Old Guard, Enrage Killbot, Mad Science Fair Project. All right, Midlife Upgrade, Goblin Haberdasher, and more or less, and Angelic. Rocket. Ooh, and there we got our first island. Full art islands. Beautiful. Islands go for four to five bucks. And of course, if you get a foil one, they're about a hundred. And uh, that'll pay for your whole box. I paid about, um, look at the back. <laughs> I paid about 140 for this box. And so really without a good, um, you get a lot of that value back with, with the lands. You have 36 packs, um, but really it's about the uh, getting a nice foil or two. Selfie preservation, well, crocodile. There's a the merman again. Border guardian. And ninja. There's a spike tournament grinder. A forest and then we have our two uh, con contraptions and then a fairy spy oh hello there mm -hmm. so it doesn't look like we got the god box because it would have been a foil land in each pack so far all right so spill suck we'll take a, a couple more packs just to kind of slow down these just kind of look at them but then we'll speed it up there a monkey half of a monkey and a merry oak hill is our rare nice little swampy record store 
division table. <laughs> Play on some other cards, right? And then the foiled goat. Alright. Some of the non land uh, foils that are worth over 50 bucks. We've got the Steam Clogger Boss, Knight of the Kitchen Sink, and, um, and then the Urza, which is about 40 bucks. Alright. Feisty Stegosaur, Shaggy Camel. Mother Kangaroo and Super Duper Death Ray. So no foils yet. Cramped Bunker. Another island. We'll take those all day. And our two contraptions and our clue. Full art on the back. So half of the tokens have full art, half the tokens have something funny on the back. Nope. Yep. See if maybe we get our first foil. Just desserts. So we're starting to see a lot of. I got two. One, one for each kiddo that wants the squirrel. Give me five. Slain mantis, spy eye, and the do-it-yourself Sura. <laughs> Sura. And another island. Three islands. Treadmill, top secret tunnel, and our full art zombie on the back there. All right. So we're going to just kind of speed through these commons now. Oh, I tell you, really epic punch. Extremely so zombie. No foils. Oh, we got a foil. We got a foil. It's a foil uncommon zombified. So I don't think that one's a, a real big hit, but we will put it aside. Kind Slaver, a forest, and our Newell Network, auto key, and a vampire. Full art on the back. So I think you get one foil rare per box. Um, <clears throat> I could be wrong. And I don't know if the getting a foil land equates to a rare. We'll see. Capital offense. Kind of go through these fast. If I see something that looks funny, we'll stop on it. A robo. Old-fashioned vampire and a rules lawyer. <laughs> Here's our planes, constructs, and a thopter. <clears throat> All right, about one fourth away through the box. So far, other than the lands, we're not having too much go to jail. <clears throat> so let's hope we get something a little bit better here. Steam powered and over my dead bodies. Nice little mountain and a spirit. Beautiful cards. <clears throat> oh, why does this one not want to open? So the funny part is you always see that foil at the end and you're like, did I get a foil? Alright, so let's speed up right up through these. And, oh, Night of the Kitchen Sink. Um, the foil that is worth like a hundred bucks. So... And a Griselda Monster Masher. The, the uh, contraptions also... <clears throat> there's an angel on the back. Contraptions also have foils too. Um, looked online just to see if there's any movement of those. Uh, you can get some money for the tokens, uh, kind of, and uh, contraptions, but just kind of have to bundle them up. So you don't want to throw them away. A lab robot. And the Grand Caltrucron. That's a mythic, by the way. Forest. So our first mythic. Maybe we'll put our mythics up here. It's kind of funny. <laughs> Separating mythics in a set like this. Alright. There's another squirrel. And a squirrel. 
Chittering Doom. Aerial Toastmaster, half kitten, and a better than one. Nice little planes there. And a separate. Alright, let's see if we can get a uh, another foil. Only one foil so far, one mythic so far. Dirty rat. Kind of reminds me of uh, the Unbound Flourishing Modern Horizons. Alright, and Clocknapper. Yeah. And a Beast. Make some bacon out of that. So again, we're going to need a nice foil. I think, oh, we do have a foil in this one. And it is a common defective detective. Big idea. Another swamp. And a nice elemental token. Look at that. Apologize, the air conditioner just kicked on. It's rather warm here. Um, I don't think it's going to be too loud for you. So two, about halfway through the box, and two foils. One uncommon, one common. All right, first pick, teacher's pet, Earl of Squirrel, another island. And the gnome. Oops. One of the ones with something funny on the back. Alright. Let's go ahead and get through our commons here. Nine commons. Ineffable blessing. Construct. Alright, we got two more packs for this half. Foil rare is not to be found yet. So we still have some hope on a good card. Need one of those foil lands, the island preferably. Handy dandy clone machine. And the dragon. Sit back up. Dragon Dungeons and Dragons. <laughs> Inspired by the hit magic card. <laughs> Alright. I can remember playing Dungeons and Dragons in the 80s. And I'm pretty sure magic didn't come out to 92, right? <laughs> Chatter and Doom. Hotfix. So. Accessories to murder. And, ooh, a foil squirrel. <laughs> Alright, okay, so we're officially halfway through. We need some help. There's another squirrel. We need some help. These are just beautiful cards, by the way. I love the, um, the borders. Um, I love the artwork. Oh, <laughs> there we go. That's about a $50 card right there, the Foil Forest. And that gets its own little nice place there. And then a regular forest. So the, the foil, um, interesting, the foil land does not take place of the regular land, which is very cool, since the lands are worth at least a couple bucks each. So that was a good hit, a nice $50 bill right there. Foil Forest. What I'll do when I, uh, at the end of this um, video, I'm going to kind of tally up the value of the basic lands, non foil lands, and add that to the value just because you can kind of um, group those together and sell them. And since, and since you know, you do have 36 of them. Um, 
it makes up for a good portion of the box that you're trying to get back when you do an opening. So very excited we got that. Oh, we got another foil here. And subcontract. <laughs> it's a funny one. Oddly even. Another mountain. Our clue again. To, um, it'd be interesting to see if that foil uh, forest takes the place of the foil rare. Phoebe, <laughs> head of sneak. Another swamp. Alright. No foil um, contraptions yet. What are, I've never tried to draft a, a, a deck from these and play just with this set. I don't know if you have. Um, seems like it would be a fun thing to do though. Another foil coming up here. And another foil uncommon. Super duper death ray. And a water market. Is our rare. Another island. Very nice. So... Um, I don't. So we got the foil forest, um, but we're gonna. I think I think we're gonna need at least one more hit. Oops, I messed that up. Hyperdoodle. There goes an island. So every one of those is like a four or five dollar bill. So those will help out and recouping some value. Again, paid about 140 bucks for this box. We got about 50 back with that forest. And we're bound to get a decent amount back from the lands. Uh, I keep pushing right through these. Side quests. Modular monstrosity. Um, not sure if you could get more than one foil land. Again, I don't even know if it counts as your foil rare. Um, Again, you do have your god boxes that every every one has a uh, foil land. Masterful ninja planes. Oh, <laughs> there's our. Unfortunately, that's the Earl of Squirrels, our foil rare. Um, so the land did not take it, but the Earl of Squirrel foil is only about two or three dollars. Um, nothing really to get excited about. All right. So, I don't think we get more than one foil rare. It'd be interesting to see if we get more than one foil land. Um, Night of the Kitchen Sink again. Sort of Dungeons and Dragons. Uh, mountain, Treadmill, and Gnome again. So, about three more, or uh, about seven more packs, I would say. Just desserts. Suspicious nanny. The countdown is one. Forest. The Earl of Squirrel is our foil rare, but we did get that forest. So that is good. Here's another squirrel, still squirrel, and by no means. <laughs> Oaken power suit, sap sucker, elemental again. All right. Spell suck. No foil. Animate library. Another mountain. Kind of put these together. A little bit funky. Yeah, I did that. Probably should have put the uh, contraptions there and then the tokens up there for simplicity of sorting. Alright, so. Again, even a couple of foil uncommons can do really good. So just because we don't get a we didn't get a good foil rare doesn't mean we're completely SOL. 
my vets know what that means. Fellow vets, I should say. All right. Sneak dispatcher. Graveyard busybody. Another swamp. Oh! The foil common. Arms Depot. And and let's see. we do have another foil in this pack. Rhino, Party Crasher, and another Steel of the Letter Magus. So our split screen is uh, another island. Alright, give me one sec. I have to go grab something real quick. And I'm back. Alright. I had one of the kiddos needed something. I had to call him my name. And that takes precedence over opening up a pack of cards. Believe it or not. What are you going to do? Secret base. There's a couple, I think a couple different artworks of that, by the way. Alternate arts. And I think we do have another foil. It's not a rare. It's not a land. Baron Vaughn. Ooh! <laughs> little foil mythic. Baron Vaughn Count. So, um... I honestly don't know how much that one is worth. Um, could be a good one, could be a, a, a mediocre one, we'll, we'll find out. So it's interesting, we got a, a um, I messed up the D's again, huh? Oh well, I'll figure those out. So we got a foil rare and a foil mythic. And um, too bad it wasn't the Urza Academy Headmaster. That yeah, would have been pretty sweet. So, capital offense. Alright, give me five. Slain Mantis. And as the as luck would have it, there goes a Plains. Alright, we're down to our last pack here. Start off with the capital offense. And... I don't think we see another secret. Yeah, so there's another secret base of the different artwork. Um, Steel Squirrel. Oh, we do have another foil. X is our rare. Mountain. And, oh, another rare. An Oaken Power Suit. So I don't know what that one's worth either. Uh, but we did get two foil rares. So very interesting. Headbanger and Brainyard. All right, so there we go, folks. Get a little focus on that, and and so we did get that lucky uh, foil forest. That was our that was our winner right there. So it'll be interesting to see how we did. I think we did all right. Um, Till next time, hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, these cards were fun to look at, and uh, MTG out. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment.